Let's see how we can use the deep learning models available on the living atlas of the world. We'll be using the building footprint extraction model in this tutorial. So we go to the living atlas, search for the building footprint extraction deep learning model and download it. Now that the model is downloading, the only other thing that I need to ensure is that I have the necessary deep learning libraries installed in my installation of ArcGIS Pro. I'm using ArcGIS Pro version 2.6 and I'm searching for ArcGIS deep learning framework uh, on the GitHub site where the setup for the deep learning installer is available. Uh, the deep learning libraries installer for ArcGIS Pro can be downloaded. Now in my case, I've already saved and run the setup file. So I'm already set up and I can now switch to ArcGIS Pro. So in this project, I've already loaded the raster. It's a stiff file of imagery from Sweden over which I'll be extracting the building footprints. I'm searching my geoprocessing toolbox for the detect objects using deep learning tool. Running this tool is easy. I just point it at the TIFF file, the raster that I'll be extracting the footprints from. I give a name for the output detective objects. And I point the tool at the model that I just downloaded. I can then set parameters for the model. Now, since I'm running this tool on my laptop that has limited GPU memory, I'm going to set the batch size to one. I'm also enabling non-max suppression to get rid of overlapping detections. I'm specifying that the processing extent should only be what's displayed since it's just a tutorial I wanted to run fast. And I'm specifying the cell size to be 0.3 meters per pixel. That's the cell size at which the model was trained. I've picked the GPU on which the model should run. It can also run on a CPU, but uh, it's much faster when it runs on a GPU. Now the tool has almost finished completing and in a moment we should see the extracted building footprints. Here they are. Now as you can see these footprints aren't exactly like regular buildings. They don't have straight lines and, and right angles for edges. And that's what the regularized building footprints tool in ArcGIS Pro can, can do. It can take these results from the deep learning model and regularize them using a variety of methods. I'm specifying the tolerance to be one meter and running this tool. It just takes a little while. And now I have regularized building footprints that look much cleaner and closer to buildings than the results that we got from the deep learning models. We can change the symbology of the extracted building footprints. So we can see through the imagery and see how well the model really did at extracting these building footprints. So uh, specifying an outline color of red, no color for inside the extracted polygon and here are the results from the deep learning model.